Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for decision. All three judges score this contest 48 47 for the winner by unanimous decision. And now, the new undisputed UFC featherweight champion of the world, Jermaine. Jermaine Durand to me is the UFC Women's Featherweight Champion. She's standing by here with Joe Rogan. What a moment for Holland and for Jermaine Durand to me tonight in Brooklyn, New York. A dream realized by the 32-year-old Jermaine Durand. All right, I am here with the winner. Go ahead and get your shirt on here. I'm here with the winner and new UFC featherweight champion, Jermaine Durandamy. Jermaine, first of all, congratulations. And give us your thoughts on the fight and how you feel it went. It was a close fight. She catched me in the third round with the head kick. It was close, but I came to fight and she didn't want to fight me. I'm a baller, I want to fight. But, um, Nederland, I'm sorry I put this in Dutch. Nederland, you have a UFC champion. Now, Jermaine, there were, there were two unfortunate moments at the end of the round where the buzzer had gone off and you landed shots after the fight. Or, excuse me, after the round. What was going on there? It is in the heat of the moment. I apologize. The referee told me, first time he told me, he says, it was still on the buzz. It, it wasn't meant for me to hit her after the bell. You know, it was in the heat of the moment. I, I apologize. I'm not like that. Now, and also in two moments of the fight, you got caught, you got caught with the head kick, and you also got caught with a straight left hand. How badly were you hurt, if at all? <laughs> you cannot knock me out like that. Come on. I, I, she hit me with the head kick, it was a good head kick, but I kept fighting. You know, I landed shots after that. Did you anticipate how much clinching she was gonna do? No, I hoped she was going to fight with me, you know. Holly is a tremendous champion, I truly respect her. But I love to brawl, I love to fight. Clinching is not my game, but hey, whatever. Now you're the champion, and there, there's one very clear contender that looms in the background, and that is Chris Cyborg. In many people's eyes, she it, well, in, is the only real big challenge for you at 145 pounds. Give us your thoughts on the potential meeting with her. You know, I want to fight everybody. If Chris Cyborg is the one I have to fight, I'll fight her. Right now, I really need surgery on my hand. I'm gonna get surgery on my hand, and let's see after. What's wrong with your hand? Uh, I torn ligaments in my hand and uh, in, my, in, in my fight with Larissa Pachenko. So, uh, yeah, I need to get that fixed first. Well, good luck with your surgery. Congratulations on your victory, and we look forward to seeing you defending your title. Thank you, I wanna say something. I wanna thank the fans. Brooklyn has been an honor, thank you so much. I wanna thank uh, my friends and family. I love you, my team. I love you guys, and uh, it doesn't matter. Nate Lund, you have a UFC campaign. Us. Jermaine Durandamy, ladies and gentlemen.